excited. This this is uh, I tell you, this is a dream come true for me. And uh, everything I've heard about this place is just uh, it's world class. You know, if you look what they do here at Okeechobee Outfitters, you know, there's a plan. You know, you, we get up early, up at five o'clock. You know, ultimately through all that, you got to execute. And in football, you know, to be successful and score points or stop people, you got to execute. And hunting, we can do you can do all the preparation you want, but if you if you can't uh, execute when you need to pull the trigger, then probably not going to be successful. We saw plenty of birds. There's a, there's a ton of birds here. We got one of them, one of the hens talking back to us, which was which was phenomenal. For me, I never I never called a bird in. I mean, it's 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 only, until you experience it. To me, there's nothing like it. And then we turned around, uh, we we looked right to our right, and there were two jakes just staring right at me. As they came back around this little some of this cover, there was eight of them. Yeah, they're out walking around. We didn't get a turkey killed, had some opportunities at some jakes, which we just decided to pass. Wasn't the, the purpose of the hunt, just to, just to kill a turkey. Of course, a uh, little bit tough with bad weather and being the end of the season. These, these birds make you work for it. It's the same way in football. You know, you prepare, you put together a preparation, a great plan. Like sometimes you just need a little luck. But hey, sun up, the sun down. That's what it's all about. Coach Cameron spent two mornings trying to hunt turkey. We unfortunately didn't get them within range of shooting any long beards, so we decided to switch gears and let them pursue killing a hog. Feeling good about this one. The last evening of the hunt, we was worried about storms, so we set up a ground blind over some bait. It was getting later and later. We were running out of light, and uh, just nothing was happening. So at the last minute, uh, we decided to get up and go, go check one more field while we had some light. And, Thank God we did. I mean, we got over there. There was a few hogs in the field. Uh, got one. Got one on my scope, and knocked it down. Oh, beautiful! And I think I got it. And I got it in its right shoulder, and down it went. It rolled, and it is an unbelievable feeling. And I tell you what, I'm hooked. Look at all of them. Beautiful. Good lord. It was just an awesome, awesome way to end just a, a couple great days of hunting. It was really fun to be out in the woods. Everybody searching for it. I think I might got one for you, coach. Might have found you a prize. Hurry up, run it out. Let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> what do you think, man? Look at that. Look at this guy. How about that, huh? There you go. That for you. <laughs>